being red. If you picked up the rows, then you would still have this pattern that you see, only the border and whatnot would be rows, and then the same in the black. You've got great fringe on either end. You do need to just vacuum, and then periodically you want to dry, dry clean this piece as well. Now again, 7 feet 6 inches by about 9 feet 9 inches. And when you're talking about a wool rug, this is really the highest quality that you can get. It's very soft. It's very comfortable. This was a lot of hand craftsmanship, being the fact that it was hand tufted. It's just a very pretty look, and it's also quite cushiony and I just can't resist the temptation to go ahead and step down putting my size nine feet and just rubbing around oh it just feels delicious feels wonderful just really very soft it's a nice pile on this a nice plushness to it and if you love red or you love that very pretty rose color or maybe you have a lot of black throughout your home there's nothing like walking barefoot or in your stocking feet or your Oh, that feels good. Or in your uh, <laughs> socks on a great thick rug. It's H21977. It's $267, of course, but it is 100% wool, and it's a nice big rug. Let's go back to the phone. Good morning. You're live on the air with Lisa. Who's calling, please? In the dining area. If you have a formal dining area, this would look fantastic because, again, you have those rich, deep colors. Maybe you have a lot of red. You don't want to put carpet everywhere, but this can allow you to have some of that feeling of carpet. It really is oh, just wonderful sensation to the toes and to the feet. It feels really fantastic. Lovely floral design right here in the middle as well. And again, the red here, and then you've got the other colors as I point with my toes to the other greens and all the very pretty colors that you have through here. It's just a luscious feeling and it's delightful to the eye as well. It's $267. And again, it's a big size. It's about what you saw with the red. It's just that this color is predominantly rose. Now, this may look like red on your television screen. It's rose. It's a very pretty soft, very, f just a nice soft palette. Let's do the black. So here comes the black. Show you the black. Oh, I think I like this the best. This is, oh, this is fabulous. Now, these are kind of heavy. Kevin, this is as far as I can go back. But you can see here, you even have more con Gifts for Mother's Day is coming up next hour. I will put on my shoes, head that way, reminding you, we're going to open up the fax lines, giving you an opportunity to share with us your ideas of a favorite Mother's Day gift. So we'd love to hear from you. I'll read your facts on the air if you so choose. And um, we'd love to be with you next hour, coming up in just a couple of minutes. Our mother's, in fact, I will put it right down here. Take off the old heels. That's about as unfeminine. There you go. Take off that heel. And I'm now standing on it with no assistance from the table. Thank you very much. Those big size nines, those big size nines just hanging over the edge of the old rolly kid, don't you know? Okay? So, <laughs> no, I'm not going to lie. 50-50 tour. It's the attractor. It's the long-handled magnetic retrieval tool. $17.12. Whether you're dealing with pins, screws, nails, wire, any sort of bolts, nuts, washers, springs, etc., it will allow you to pick those up in just the fraction of the time it takes for you to physically bend over and pick it up, especially if you have a bad back or you don't like having to bend over constantly. This is perfect. 41 inches long is your length on the handle. Let me just show you how strong this is. These are some really big gym clips, and they're actually very large. And it's going to pick those up. I'm going to run over the pins, and it's going to pick those up. And then let me get over here to our nails. I may have it a little too heavy, but probably not. And it picks all of those up. So you can see, <laughs> just by that demonstration alone, whether you do have a bad back and you don't like bending over or not have to break, um, break your back bending over constantly. Very strong magnetic pull on this. Try to take these off real quickly. Be with you in just a second. And we'll do it again. <laughs> There's really no easy way to take it off, is there? You just have to kind of do it because this has a very strong magnetic pull. Is it pulling it back up as I'm trying to do this? <laughs> I'm glad this is of such interest to you and so fun. <laughs> All right, here we go. I'm working on it. Shall we go to the phone and give me a break? Well, it's not working. Every time I try to take a...
<laughs> oh, it's pulling it right. It, it is very powerful. Good afternoon. Welcome to QVC. Who's calling? Uh, this is Diane. Hi there. How are you? Very good. <laughs> and I'm from Garden Grove, California. Good to have you with us today. What do we have for you? Uh, I picked up the tornado mixer. Had you ever seen that before? No, I hadn't. It really looks like a good thing. It really is. It's very nice. It uh, is portable. I'm sure that you saw a lot of the things that we went over, but it's great to be able to have a mixer like that with no sharp edges. So if, if, it, if you have... Pretty much repel stains on its own. It really doesn't need a lot of maintenance. You know what? Just to get an idea... Excuse my foot. I'm, let me just stand in front of this, and let's look all the way up to the top. I'm with these heels. I'm four. And I'm 5'7", so... Well, this is a, this is a big talk with you. Oh, yeah. i got to take the take shoe shoes off, off and get the foot into Then you could really the feel rug. how soft yes. the pile is. I know. You know, I could take a pillow at this point, lie down, and nap on this Picture rug. Picture this rug in the family room. This is so plush. In I mean, a family room, just, just sitting right on, on the floor watching oh, TV. It's wonderful. This Getting is out of bed wonderful. in the morning on a nice cold winter You know morning. what? The other thing too, Sandy, and I, and I know you know this because you're the expert, but wool repels. Wool is not one of those fabrics that's, that pulls in dirt and, and like if you have a worsted wool suit or a wool suit, exactly. you can oftentimes just brush it away. Natural fibers clean yeah. much better. Also, wool won't hold that's a plane. That's good. So 